Hello and welcome to Total Television. I'm Brian Dolby reporting live from Lisbon where I'm absolutely delighted to be joined by Darius Digalvis, who is the CTO for TEO, the PTT of Lithuania. Darius, Lithuania has stolen the limelight here. You've come out as number one in FTTH. Tell me how you've gone about it. <laughs> Yeah, it was new for, for us, it's also, it's not only new for you, but I mean, on behind that, it's really big job made in country, from my understanding. Uh, I start think what it was reasons, really, for that to becoming number one in uh, fiber de 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 deployment in this, kind, I mean, in Lithuania. Lithuania is quite small country, three and a half billion people, but, uh, I mean, one of reason it was a really tough competition in Lithuania according broadband. Can you imagine in country where it's three and a half million people living one, more than 100 competitors in Lithuania? I mean, and it's really, I mean, competition very high. And most of these competitors, it's not competitors which is just buying DSL from incumbent operator, but just they owning infrastructure in Lithuania. I mean, they build themselves infrastructure. In this case, this infrastructure competition really pushing forward to compete in higher, how to say, service level uh, and higher te with higher technologies and uh, give for customers uh, better service on uh, broadband. It was first reason. Second reason, of course, Lithuania, half population in Lithuania are situated in multi-flat houses, uh, which is a bit simplifying this case. I mean, uh, it's um, a bit cheaper to come and install this new infrastructure. Third case, for my understanding, most important in this case, which is unique in Europe, uh, in this, uh, in this, uh, how to say, race, step up incumbent operator. Usually in Europe for this moment, not many incumbents actively, very actively going to this uh, race and uh, still have some thinking uh, what to do, how to do and so on. Lithuanian, um, Teo, Lithuanian PTT did the step two and a half year ago practically, take this decision and say we will go for FTTH, we will go for real FTTH, it means not for FTTB, in this case like doing as a competitor and uh, we started. Now we get this result in two and a half year. I think, I think, I mean, uh, this density of FTTH customers really impressive. If look to the world, if look to the Europe. Yeah, it's fantastic. And what are some of the new services that you're able to offer because you now have this infrastructure? Yeah. I mean, in Lithuania, people very much uh, looking to the speed they like. Uh, have fast internet because uh, through the fast internet they are getting a lot of different services like streaming, HD TV, like uh, catch catch up TV and other kind of interactive uh, uh, video related content services. Uh, I mean uh, only FTTH structure able to carry this kind of services, otherwise uh, through DSL or through mobile application it's impossible to do. And in Lithuania many, I mean customers using this kind of uh, application, this kind of content, heavy content, of course gaming uh, and so on, uh, it's very popular. And that is the reason why customer likes the services and why all competitors and all operators giving for customers this kind of service. I see, and and you obviously you've been here in Lisbon for the last couple of days. What what impressions have you been left from from this event of the FTTH Council mm -hmm. meeting here? Yeah, for me this event all, all the time was very interesting, and I like this. Uh, I mean uh, this event in Lisbon, in Lisbon, because uh, how to say we start talk not only about FTTH technology, we start talk about content. Content is very important because for customer usually not care about technology. They would like to have such technology which is allowed it to give what they want, to, to get what they want in this case. And uh, for its operator task becoming to give good content also and uh, how to say not only white pie but also help to customers uh, get uh, as more qualified, higher quality content. Okay, well look, thank you very much for talking to us. So we know that if we want high-speed broadband, we head for Lithuania. Yes, please come. It will be a pleasure. Thank you very much.